Hi, my name is Kevin McIntyre. I'm the superintendent of the Milford Public Schools, and this is my Milford TV story. I love Milford TV. They've been a fantastic community partner for us. We work with them on a number of fronts. They work with us very, very closely with our athletic program, televising the games for members of the community who can't get to the games on their own, which I think is a fantastic community service. Um, I do monthly superintendent updates with Milford TV, which I think are, are, is, is a fantastic way from my perspective to get my message out to the community. We also um, have Milford TV engage in a number of kind of one-off programs and productions, which are extremely helpful whether it's a, a, a music concert, whether it's an event that they're covering, whether it's school committee. Uh, Milford TV is, is very engaged and involved in the life of the Milford Public Schools and I want to thank them for their efforts and I hope it to, this partnership to continue in the future. I would say my favorite Milford TV moment was when we did the um, I Love uh, the Milford Public Schools campaign and we had a number of students, uh, faculty members, parents and community members talking about their personal experiences with the, um, with the Milford Public Schools and we used this video on the opening day um, when we brought all our faculty back and it was extremely powerful and we also shared the video um, on social media so I think it had an incredible and widespread impact. I would say that the FCC is making a terrible mistake. I don't think they realize the value that local cable TV has on local communities. Milford TV is an invaluable resource to the Milford Public Schools in the Milford community, and it's a resource that I would hate to see diminish or to go away because it allows so many more people access into what we do and, and shares kind of all the great things that are happening in the Milford Public Schools. So I want to thank Milford TV, and I, and I hope that there's no change to the current FCC regulations.